Also in August, Ian Wright travels to the Tahuka region of Japan for the Amuri Nabuta Festival. The Buta are floats made out of paper, representing legendary stories. They date back to the 9th century, when a beleaguered general built a large Nabuta to frighten the enemy. Today, they take a year to make, and are judged before the winners are placed on barges and pushed out into the bay. In a couple of hours' time, all these floats that you see are suddenly going to come alive. The Nabuta festival takes place over six days and is one of the largest festivals in Japan, attracting more than three million visitors from all over the country. Right, this is it. It's actually about to start. This is our Nabuta, which means float. Everyone has their own legend, yeah? And this one is about... There's the samurai. That's his helper. The samurai's lost the battle. He's going to kill himself. And his manservant is fending off the attackers. That's why he's got them arrows in him. Over 20 Nabuta floats are pulled by people in the streets of Amuri City, and it's a festival where the public actively participates, egged on by some 200,000 shouting dancers. See, the thing is, when you're a bit knackered because you've been dancing, you need a little pick-me-up. And what's better than a little bit of sake? Can I have some? Yeah? Yeah! Ah, oh, is that a bit small for me? I need a bigger pot. I'm turning Japanese. Woo! 